How you feeling? Dead. You take your monster. We sat on a plane for 14 hours and then another plane for five hours. Even do eight hours, I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm not gonna do it. You wouldn't do eight hours? No, I don't do eight hours. <laughs> Five hours. That's all. Hi guys, we made it. We landed in Miami. Me and Joel. We we're just saying it was a uh, 20, 24 hours of traveling, and we probably slept, I think, three to I four hours. Did you? Yeah. I slept maybe three hours in the whole thing, but we did get um, poor man's first class because there were, it was a really empty plane, so we both had a row to ourselves. So we just kicked the feet up the entire leg of the flight. So it actually wasn't wasn't too bad at all. Um, but it just feels a bit out of whack because it's like 8 a.m. Melbourne time and here I think it's about 5 p.m. So very, very strange. But on the way to the hotel now, um, and then we are going to, I think, sneak in a gym session just so we can reset a little bit. I tend to do that every time I travel. And then we will um, go eat somewhere. So first things first, this, this is helping us really get through this. But first impressions. Day. Yeah, mother's milk. First impressions actually look sick. It's, it's hot, but it's not too hot. Not like it came here last time, it was just really uncomfortable. Um, and so far the people are nice. We met one person, and he's a legend. Even though he nearly hit someone. Didn't nearly run a guy over before. So you tell your friend, <laughs> yeah? Yeah, <laughs> we're telling all the friends. Uh, about Miami, eh? Yes. Yeah. I need to change so bad, it's disgusting. I could eat again and I've eaten for the last <laughs> yeah. Literally, all Joel's done is eaten. We just sat in the plane. I was trying to, I brought my own food with me, and he was, they'd give him a meal, he'd eat that. Then I'd give him my meal, he ate that. And then he bought snacks, smashed those. Literally didn't stop eating. I think it's like, you think you stayed up the whole night eating? I could eat again. Same, that's the issue. I've been, I've been starving as well, so find, maybe find something more. Do you want to just train first and we'll eat? Yeah, yeah, we'll get over and done with. Build up an appetite. So we're eating breakfast and like eating a burrito at two in the morning. That's what it felt like. Weird. So checking into the hotel now. This looks insane so far. So time for gym. We're gonna go down to Equinox, hit some back. Um, we probably will tear it off the bone because I'm feeling very uh, tight after 20 hours on the plane traveling. But it's literally what I need to do to reset. So it's about 6.30 now. It does not feel like 6.30. It feels so much earlier, I swear. What do you want for dinner, Joel? No idea. There are so many options for food here. Even the room service menu is insane. We'll figure out, figure out some food. So guys, we're officially in gym heaven right here. This is Equinox. I'm really scared to film because I'm scared they're going to take it off me, but we get some footage. So this is the sickest, cleanest gym I think I've ever been in. So we need some back today. Let's check this out, guys. Guys, so we just came back from the back workout. Plan is now gonna order some room service because it's already late, it's like eight o'clock, and then um, check out the pool as well while we wait. So, classic Cubano sandwich, um, so mac and of, cheese, uh, mac and cheese, a fresh farm vegetables, but with no just plain with nothing on them, so no oil or no butter. Could I also get a peanut butter cookie, please? From the kids' menu. Uh, yes, please. Bang. Crazy. Sick. Yeah, I'm in life, not too warm. That's alright. Please go in. 
Yeah, see, I couldn't, I couldn't handle that whole, whole body, that tent now. Really? No. I'm fine. <laughs> it's official, we've finally found heaven on earth, <laughs> right here. Bathrobe is on and the room service has arrived. Check out what we got. Heaven. Absolute heaven. Joel's cookies, sandwich with chips. What's that, bread? Yeah. Nice. Um, I got some veg. That mac and cheese looks so good. And I got chicken as well. Oh, oh. perfect. <laughs> this That's is so good. heaven on earth right here. Chip, heaven and hell. Heaven. Jeez, we've been here for like 10 minutes. We've already fucked the entire place. You peek it. Give him one of these chips. Should have got sweet potato fries, actually. All right. So, guys. We're gonna just chill for the rest of the night. It's getting late anyway. I'm starting to feel pretty dead. And we've got this to smash down. So, we will see you in the morning. Good morning, guys. So, day one here, officially. Or well, day two, it's day two. But, um, how's this? We just took a little walk down to the water. Last night was pure hell, I'm not gonna lie. We got, I reckon, four hours sleep, I think. I woke up at 2.30 a.m. and did not get back to sleep at all. So I waited, we talked some shit, looked at some restaurants on Yelp at 3 in the morning, and then went to gym at like 4.30 and smashed out a cardio workout. I don't feel tired at all. Yeah, it's gonna hit us, it's gonna hit us soon though, I think. So we just thought we'd come down here, um, watch the sunrise from the water, so it's nearly, it's about 7 o'clock, and it's, it's dead, there's like nobody here, but guys, this scenery is sick, like, check this out. How good. That is awesome. I'm gonna try to get the drone out as well, but we'll see what happens. Yeah, nice one. Duncan. This is so good. All right, let's see if we can get some drone footage. Not too sure what the regulations are regarding drones, but we'll see. So I was too hungry, I completely forgot to even record this. So I'm halfway through. <laughs> The first round of brekkie. I might um, go back for some sweet. Joel said the cake's pretty good. Chocolate banana muffin's good. Oh, shit, we've got a French toast coming, haven't we? Mm -hmm. Oh, good, we still got more food coming, so I'll show you guys soon. <laughs> yeah, give us a syrup pour on the pancakes, Joel. That's cream on top. Yeah, get the syrup on this. So we're down here now at uh, Wynwood Walls. I think it's called Wynwood. Um, forgive me if I'm butchering that, but this is like, looks like the arty kind of part of town, I think. It's um, basically just a whole bunch of graffitied walls, which look insane. So we're gonna go check them out and, um, and see what we're gonna store. Today, hopefully we'll get a lot of shopping done as well. So we wanna go to the design district, um, go to different malls, hopefully some Shake Shack, fingers crossed. Cheat day today, just one day. Because that was Winwood, and it turns out that like every shop is just like essentially graffiti with art. It's sick. Um, so we hung around there for a little bit, and then we are now in the fashion district. So I've never felt more poor in my life. So <laughs> many shops. We are definitely out of our out of our I ain't got no zone here. <laughs> yeah. But we're gonna have a look around. We can do some window shopping. If I see anything that's just sick, that's just too good, I'm gonna have to get it. But we are well out of our price range here. But we'll still, we'll still have a look, so fingers crossed if you find something sick. Yeah, that's sick. God damn it. We're gonna have to shut it down. They are super comfortable. <laughs> So this just had to be done, no matter what. Pure heaven, guys, pure heaven. We should knock us into a food coma. We should know. So we're gonna smash this and see you soon. Literally, I can't even, I can't even think. It's so good. 
All right, guys, so the lack of sleep has caught up to me and Joel. We fell asleep in the Uber for like 10 minutes, knocked out hard. So we just went down the pool, tried to reset for a little bit, because it's like 4.30 now and we're just gonna train. So um, starting to get a little bit tired, but I think if we get in a good gym session, that'll kind of reset us a little bit. And then off to an early night tonight, because we've got a photo shoot in the morning. So I would rather have a good night's sleep. But we did, we did shut down Gucci. Not really. We, we went in there and bought a pair of shoes each. <laughs> and it was like the most impulsive decision. But I was just saying to Joel that I'm, I'm happy with it because then it's like good memories of the trip as well as like six shoes. So I'll, I'll show you what we got. These are, I think these are Joel's ones. The individually wrapped bags. How good is this? Yeah, these are Joel's. I reckon these are sick. Check that. Noise. Bang. How sick is that? I know you guys are probably thinking, why would you spend money on a shoe that already looks dirty? <laughs> but I think it's actually, it's gonna work in my favor because now, now I can't really get these dirty because if they do get dirty, I can just say, well, they're meant to be like that. <laughs> and then people can't, they can't argue. So that is, um, let me get in frame. That is what we did today. And I'm very happy with it. So we got a few other bits and pieces as well, um, but these are the main, these are the main items. So we are just gonna have a chill one. Go train some arms. Uh, I won't take you guys with me because this bad boy's running flat. But um, but yeah, and then I think we're just gonna have an early night. Maybe get some some sushi and call it a day, and recontinue this tomorrow. So we'll see you guys then. So guys, last day here in Miami. Leaving today. Last night went out to. Oh, story and uh, Lil Wayne was there which is pretty cool Joel's favorite so we had to go there and got back last night about 4 30 currently feeling a bit like hell but anyway we're gonna get us all sorted and uh, we'll see you guys there we made it to cold New York so this is actually sick I forgot how like bright everything is it looks like daytime it's about 7 o'clock at night Joel's still hung over to the shit house Feels, feels like hell. It's a beach of yourself. <laughs> it's a beach of yourself. That means getting absolutely killed. But, check it out. So guys, that is it for me. I did hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and you guys know what to do. Stay massive. Fresh cut in the denim, all these sexy jeans in my section. Slide into your DMs in the PM and the AM. Then I slide into your feelings when you see just what I'm saying.